Okay, I'm here with Tony. Tony from Hawaii, and uh, Tony's video has gotten a lot of popularity, a lot of likes on our on our Facebook page and our uh, YouTube page. But uh, he is here one year after his surgery, and I'm going to actually put some befores and afters right next to where he is now, and you can really see the difference. Uh, I came back to visit because I'm just looking for just a little more density. Yeah. Uh, the very first procedure, we actually brought my hairline down almost two inches. Mm -hmm. So I basically had nothing to begin with. So Mickey now, Mouse ears, right? Yes, the Mickey Mouse ears. So we're starting from an area that had zero hair. Nothing. We're bring nothing. So when you do that, again, with the 30, 40% having light skin, dark hair, it tends to be a little more gappy. So a second pass, like you're doing today, yep. uh, is going to really kind of be the finished product and fill in a lot of that gappiness. Fill so, it up in density. Absolutely. Um, how I'm here with Tony from Hawaii and Tony has just completed his second hair transplant surgery and again he let us shave his head which again is not mandatory but definitely helps things not only for us but for him when he's watching this stuff later the chance of him dislodging a graft um, this is just gonna be a perfect uh, result I'm gonna show uh, what we've done and then I'll ask him about the day and you can see how jam-packed that is. We reinforced the temple. We actually thought about whether we need to or not, um, but his, uh, I have a feeling that once he gets the increased density in the front, he's gonna want um, that sort of to match the, the same density, so. But this is gonna be unbelievable, and this is really gonna put him over the top. He already looks amazingly improved with just the one procedure, getting that 30%. But this should really put him over the top. But Tony, how was your day today? And um, what did you do? Really relaxful. Yes. Um, I actually fell asleep. Yes. You know, the flight here was strenuous. 15 so it hours. Was, it was really nice from to Hawaii. actually sit down and yeah. take a nice nap. I feel almost rested and Good. ready to eat. And you're going back tomorrow, I understand. I am. Wow, um, a quick trip. I just want to kind of travel back home just yeah. to you know ensure that if there is any swelling that I'll be in the comfort of my own home right but I mean looking well, at it I doubt I'm gonna have any swelling fingers crossed yes yes uh, I didn't have the, any last time so hopefully and the key not. is really just resting afterwards and not doing much that's Rest gonna help as well. a little ice on the forehead yeah we actually took out his old scar you wanted to just be left with one scar so yeah. now he still has one scar and um, yeah, couldn't be happier. So thanks again, uh, Tony, for updating your, your fans. And uh, and really, I know a lot of people like your video. They like your personality, and you're getting a lot of comments on these YouTube uh, video. But uh, thanks again, and I cannot wait. I wish I could fast forward everything to next year. Uh, but this is really going to be a difference, and I can't wait to see your befores and afters from this one and last one. So this should be it for a while for Tony after this surgery. He's, you know, unless he somehow loses more hair in the back, which could happen, you know, hair loss is a continuous process. He is on some medications like minoxidil, the laser uh, helmet or, or band that he wears mm -hmm. to try to slow that down. But uh, I'm really happy the way things went today um, and super excited to see his results. Thanks again, Tony. Call us now, 844-327-4247, and ask about our Hue and Hue Plus procedures, which move more hair than ever before. Hope to hear from you soon.